What's up guys? Welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Shandy here. If you're new, thank you so much for watching. On this channel, we talk about manifestation, law of assumption, lifestyle mindset, and all those great topics that tie into one another. In this video, I want to talk about the trying mindset. We have to ditch this trying mindset, trying to manifest, trying to do this, trying to stay positive. Stop trying and just do. As you all know, on this channel, we take accountability and I'm going to always say that in my videos. Taking accountability is the first step to manifesting the things that you want in your life and just having the things that you want. So we're going to have to talk about that. I'm going to go into depth about why you should stop trying, why you should just eliminate the word trying from your vocabulary in general. Just ditch it, okay? Ditch it all together. So if you guys want to stick around for that video, let's get right into it. Trying, trying, trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. I am trying. But there's always going to be a but after that trying as long as you tell yourself that you're trying. Why is it important to ditch this trying mindset? It's important to ditch the trying mindset, especially when you're manifesting things in your life, because trying indicates that it's not happening. To say that you're trying to do something emphasizes the fact that maybe it is not working out for you. I'm trying, but it's not working. I'm trying, but I don't see anything. I'm trying, but I feel a delay. You know, any of those words or any of those phrases are going to follow up as long as you keep telling yourself you're trying to do something. Don't try. Just do. Just do it. There's no emphasis behind it or anything. There's nothing to it except to just do it. <laughs> As long as you're telling yourself you're trying, you are going between two states of consciousness. I'm trying to manifest, I'm, I'm trying to think positive, but I can't. Why? Because you keep believing in your old story. I'm trying to manifest, I'm trying to think positive, but I keep thinking about this. You're validating your old story. You have to just let that go. Stop finding a reason to validate your old stories, guys. You have to stop trying. And this is this goes for anyone who is in the trying mindset. Well, I'll try it. I'll see. You know, it just brings doubt. It just leaves room for doubt. It leaves doubtful energy. Trying leaves room for failure. And if you tell yourself, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. Nine times out of ten, ten times out of ten, you're going to have success. I'm going to think positive. You can literally hear the difference between I'm going to try to think positive and I'm going to think positive. I'm going to be confident enough to think positive. I'm going to be confident enough to know that my manifestation can reach me. My desire can reach me. My desired outcome can reach me. I am going to do it, not I'm going to try to do it. You have to dish this trying mentality and this trying mindset. Like I said, all you're doing is validating your old stories and validating you know, things that you no longer want to believe in by telling yourself you're going to try because it's that comfortable for you. Sometimes we don't even realize how comfortable we are sticking in our old stories and these old thoughts because we've been having them for so long. So it's like, you know what? I'm so used to this way of thinking, but I'll give it a shot to try to think differently. I'm not sure that it's going to be successful, but let's just see. Stop thinking like that. Just because you don't say it out loud doesn't mean that your subconscious is not feeling that. Stop trying and just do it. There's nothing to it but to do it. Like, I know there's people who might say, like, it's easier said than done. It's really not. I used to be one of those people that was like, it's so much easier to say, you know, think positive or sometimes it really is just that simple. Maybe you might feel some wavering in the beginning periods because you've been confirming certain stories for so long. If you really sit and commit yourself to thinking a certain way, persisting in a certain way, affirming a certain way, the way that you affirm and persist in your old stories, if you gave that much energy to your new stories, I promise you things will look different. I promise you, you will not have a delay in your manifestations. I promise you these manifestations can show up in three days or less. As long as you dish that trying mindset and stop telling yourself, I'm going to see what happens. I don't know if, I don't know, but I'll see. Get rid of that. Believe in yourself. Believe in what you can have because anybody who's ever had something that they desire, anybody who's ever manifested something, especially in a short time period is because they knew. It's because they were confident and they persisted in the fact that this was going to happen. I don't care who says what. This is my world. I can create whatever I want to create when I want to create it. So fuck trying anything. Excuse my language, but fuck trying anything. I'm going to just do it because this is my life. And this is something that I want. So I'm not going to try to get it. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. You have to be assertive in what you want if you are going to manifest what you want. Stop shying away from your own life. 
This is your world. Whatever you create, whatever you think is going to come back to you. So as long as you're trying to do something, you're going to be stuck in that mentality. I'm not saying that you're going to you're not going to manifest things. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying is you are going to put a delay to the things that you want to manifest because you you are giving the option of not having it. You're giving the option of going back to your old story. You're giving yourself the option of just not fully committing to what you want. If you're trying, you're not fully committed. Because as long as you are fully committed to something, it does not have a choice but to work out for you. It does not matter. As long as you are fully committed and you are fully persisting and you are fully affirming in the things that you want in your life, it does not have a choice but to reach you. Like, I promise you, I kid you not. Like, I've seen it happen in my life over and over and over again. And any time in the past where I would waver between doing and trying, doing and trying, it de most definitely delayed some shit. It most definitely delayed what I wanted. It most definitely, you know, set me back a little bit until I made the commitment in my life to say, you know what, I'm not trying to do anything anymore. I'm just going to do it. Until I finally sat down and decided, no, I'm going to do this. And I am this. And I have this. So that's just what it is. And it started showing back up in my world. I'm not sure how long this video is going to be, but I just wanted to make a short video of ditching the trying mindset because guys you really do just have to do it just do it like nike okay just do it i promise you put yourself to the test for the next three days commit fully and whatever you want whatever it is you want start with something small okay because it's more believable for you even if it's like a free cup of coffee like i get a free cup of coffee every day i get a free cup of coffee every day and watch how you get that free cup of coffee now i'm gonna try to get a free cup of coffee every day no I'm gonna get a free cup of coffee every single fucking day and watch you get that free cup of coffee every day it's gonna it doesn't have a choice but to reach you that's all i really wanted to say in this video you know just ditching that trying mindset and really just committing to the things that you want in your life being confident in the things that you want in your life being accountable for your thoughts accountable for your actions and really like getting the shit that you want get it done like it can be done that being said guys i'm gonna wrap this video up here if you like what you heard please like comment share and subscribe as i mentioned in my previous videos before i am now doing one-on-one -on -one coaching if you guys are interested in that please check out the email in my description box and i really don't have much to say at the end of this video except for keep doing what you're doing i'm gonna always speak about the fact that you're not doing anything wrong things are being moved for you as long as you're doing and you're not giving way to your old stories and your old thoughts and your old beliefs keep on going guys and that's what we all have to say and i would most definitely see you guys in my next video